All right, guys, I had done an extensive video of showing you how I had uh, notched everything out. What I did was, with uh, the 2x4s, I set my circular or um, bandsaw, not bandsaw, circular saw, um, at 3 quarter inches, made several grooves in, and then cut them sideways as well, okay? And uh, so that's going to be the framing for the outside. And... Of course, as I'm doing it and I'm talking away, I didn't realize that my batteries had died, so it didn't work. So what I'm going to just kind of show you what I'm doing here is the way these are going to get set up. And I'll bring the camera over so you can see better. So with the 2x4s, I got them notched out so that they're connecting together. The 2x8s underneath, and it all gets screwed together, okay? The frames for the solar panels will fit right inside of here. And I modified it a little bit. I made everything a little bit wider. And, um, you know, um, I actually went with the 8 feet because these over here, the frames are 7 feet. And you see the window on top. I can actually push the solar panels up so if it's winter time I can actually push the panel from below I can push that right up and that gives me more room that way you know for the snow coming in and then also if I go with the extra foot because these are all seven foot I'm going with eight foot on my design so that this way I have another foot of area that if the snow comes I can push these up block them up so that they stay higher in the frames and then that way they're not sitting on the ground as much okay so um, what I'll do then is once I put because like I said the solar panels will fit right inside the frame once this is all screwed together and then I'll take the two by sixes and that'll go on the outside edge like that to keep the panel more secure in the frame. So what I'm actually going to do with those is I'm going to keep them out a little bit farther and I think what I'll end up doing with um, these ones, these two by sixes on here, I may pull those off and cut them back a little bit so that I have more of the panel exposed and that's that was like you know one issue that people had brought up which is true that part of the panels are blocked because of the framing so um, that's what I'm doing so I just, it, it's actually quite time consuming with the 2x4s cutting all that out. It's been a pain in the behind actually, to be honest with you. But, uh, so this is what, basically what it's going to look like. I have to screw this one all together and then I have to do it two more times. So um, basically right now, what time is it, Ma? Uh, 20 to 12. So it's almost 12 now. I don't even know what time I started here on everything. But, uh, so that's the first one kind of done except it needs to be all screwed together, okay? And then I just have to um, cut down the 2x4s again and, uh, in, like, in the back in half, and then that'll go for... I'll show you this back here. The, and I'll put these them that way, and then I just got to drill a hole through them, um, put these on, and then that way that's my braces. So that's kind of what, what I'm farting around doing today um, I don't know how much longer I'm gonna go today to be honest with you just because of the fact that uh, I do have to sleep some this afternoon and everything so I, I may try to get at least the second one done um, f framed out anyway okay not screwed down yet but um, this project will be done this week and this is what I'm gonna be working on because like I said in an earlier video um, today that uh, the next three days after today even are going to be really, really nice. So I'm going to kind of see how much I can get done and just kind of focus on working on this, uh, doing the frame part of it for the the thing. So it's just it's going to take some time, but uh, I will get it done. And, uh, you know, like I said, once I get it all screwed together, I'll show you guys that. Or I maybe even do it on camera and show you what I'm doing on camera so that you can see how I've done it all. But... Uh, yeah, so that's that's how it's going, and uh, I don't think I'm doing too terribly bad 
for an amateur. <laughs> but you know, it's like I get a lot of uh, grief because I didn't do a lot of the stuff myself. And uh, my thing was, um, if I get somebody that knows how to do it, I'd rather pay somebody that knows what they're doing than try to go at it half-ass, basically. And uh, I'm not going to do it like that. So um, this here, I had a basic outlay of what he did by looking at his other stuff. And I said to myself, you know what, I got the tools, and uh, I can do it, and I'm going to do it myself. And uh, so that's what I'm doing. And I don't think I'm doing a horrible job, but, you know, you guys tell me. <laughs> and what I'll do is um, when I do another, I'll do another video and I'll show you how I did that um, chiseling, uh, chiseling it out and stuff like that once I got that part of it done. I'm disappointed that the battery died on me, but what are you going to do? Um, so that's what I'm working on and I will talk to you guys later. Prepper Nurse went out for now. Oh, and by the way, it's beautiful and yes, I have my shirt off because when it gets warm, the shirt comes off. So you're gonna see a lot of it this summer as it warms up. See, I like the heat. I really, truly do like the heat. Um, people say, oh, you know, it's gonna get too hot. You're not gonna wanna do nothing. That's when I really like to do stuff is being out when it's warm. So as soon as, I mean, and it's funny because it's warm, it's like 60 degrees today. So, you know, you get working and you're busy, it gets warm. So anyway, guys, listen, um, have a great day. Treat each other with kindness, you know, um, realistically the only person in life that can hold you back is yourself and tomorrow is dead and gone there's nothing you can do about the past but the future is wide open and it's your oyster if you will you can make it whatever you want if you want it to be a miserable existence guess what that's exactly what it's going to be if you want it to be positive and happy that's up to you it's your choice so you know stay positive and remember it's one thing at a time one step at a time one day at a time and you're going to reach your goals whatever they are all right, I'll talk to you later. Prepper Nurse went out for now.